Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Pro Wrestling Ontario presents Ignite. My name is Nathan Savage, joined here with my commentary partner, Mr. Jeff Goodrich. The manager of champions once again sitting with the illustrious Mark. We are going to be starting things off here tonight with relentless John Atlas taking on Sam Osborne, who is debuting here tonight for Pro Wrestling Ontario. Oh, man. So what's the story with this uh, with the Aussie here? I, I've never seen this kid before. Who, who is he? Uh, Sam Osborne's been ripping it up for quite a little while now. No pun intended there to a glance back at his partnership uh, and his tag team, the Ripper Ruse. Uh, he went to Battle Arts. The Japan. Ripper? Is that a real thing? Yeah, him and um, I'm having trouble placing his old partner. Oh, that's game. lovely. A couple Aussie good buddies. Know that you've done, good to know that you've done your research. And, you, and you're aware that the dingo did eat his baby. Bell sounded here. All right, John Atlas and Sam Osborne ready to square off here. A little stare down to each other. Second time we've seen John Atlas here at Pro Wrestling Ontario. A little different uh, this time around. It seemed like the last time him and Jesse Mack and uh, was it Dylan Daniels? He was, uh, he was with uh, Jody Threat and uh, Jake O'Reilly. God, you know what? It was, it was so long ago. Yeah, back in March. Jesse uh, Mack was on the other side of the ring. That's why yes. I. That's why I said that. Yes. See, back in uh, back in March, John Atlas debuted here with uh, alongside Jake O'Reilly and uh, Jody Threat, where there was a little bit of falling out between Jake and uh, and John. As John has him over in full Nelson as uh, Sam gets out, wraps well, around. I'll tell you the thing is, is that the uh, the action is so hot and heavy here at Pro Wrestling Ontario. I mean, sometimes it's tough to keep the show straight. You are not wrong there, as uh, Sam has him held up there. As, uh, John, John gets out, get him in a wrist lock. Sam trying to fight out there. Rolls nice over. roll out of that. Sam with the wrist lock nice. of his own now. Fans getting behind Osborne. Respect for these fans. Nice sportsmanship. John rolls through, but Sam oh. is just too quick for him. Referee Hitchcock says that John is still good to go. Hey, you watch your mouth. Oh, that's his name. Oh, I'm sorry. I apologize. All right. John Atlas is working his way back up to his feet. Now Sam Osborne is trying to stay in control. You know, a few people are aware, but uh, John Atlas is actually a cancer survivor. Um, you are not wrong. Strong, uh, strong advocate of the... Uh, the Shiki's green medicine for his uh, for his cancer recovery. There's a small package from uh, Sam Osborne. Uh, John kicks out at two. Sam goes to pull him through. Backslide. Atlas kicks out at two. Rolls out of the ring. You know, I will say, um, 
this Hitchcock got down pretty quickly there. I like I like a referee who's involved and and oh vocal too. I like this referee. Another man who's actually debuting for Pro Wrestling Ontario tonight, referee Hitchcock, is doing a phenomenal job so what far. What is his Jeff first Goodrich. name? You don't know his first name? His first name is Stephen. Steve. Steve Hitchcock. All right. As uh, John Atlas gets back into the ring. Ready to square off. Maybe a little test of strength. I see Steve Hitchcock got a little snow on the roof. Hoping that uh, he's still got 20-20 vision. Oh, get in there, Steve. Come on. Same goes for the cover. John gets out real quick, wrestles him back up to his feet. Looks like maybe we're going for a suplex and a gnarly suplex at that. Osborne goes for the cover. Kick out at one. You should have never told me his name. I am going to ride him all night long. I'm not going to touch that one. Um. Wait, no, I want to change. Moving on. <laughs> Back to the action in the ring. Both men are back up to their feet, squaring off yet again. They seem to be on a rather even playing field here tonight, wouldn't you say, Jeff? Uh, yeah, I would say that this has been going back and, back and forth pretty uh, even-handedly. Uh, both guys are sort of a catch-as-catch -catch hand style right now as John Adler is able to fire off with a great shoulder block, going down for two. And his Aussies retreated off to the corner. Take a little rest. The fans maybe, he, maybe he needs a Vegemite break. Very well might be. All right, both men back to their feet yet again. Locking up, collar and elbow tie up. Sam gets through, going for the hammer lock. Going to a side headlock. Who do you think you're most excited to see tonight, Mark? Uh, I, personally, I would, I'm, I'm excited for uh, the number one contendership for the trios championships. We have straight up flight taking on Desired by Design. Beautiful hip toss there as John goes in. The roll over, comes goes, back off. It's the rope, and Sam hits him with a, with a devastating drop kick. Because I was going to say, I can't wait for, Ma, uh, for Mark Shaw to uh, absolutely um, neuter Matt Grant. Oh, 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 John's fighting back in the corner. I hate to cut you off there. As we're going through. Osborne kicks him back. Oh, John just whips out the ankle right from underneath him, sending Osborne down to the mat. Looks like he's got a little bit of lower back trouble after that one. Well, John's yeah, that smarty. number's a problem now. Absolutely. Now, if John is smart, he'll stay on top of his opponent here. He's listening to the ref rather nicely, actually. Well, and so he should. Nice. Now, see, this is a beautiful move on the part of John Atlas, doing something very similar to Warren Anderson or Ole Anderson. He's picked out a body part, and he's now going to dissect said body part. He's working that back over extensively. Let see if we can maybe get this kid to slip a disc. That'd be all right. Especially maybe after that devastating Irish whip into the corner as John Atlas goes for the cover. Sam Osborne, Osborne kicks out relentlessly at two. Point out referee Hitchcock has been very good with those counts. They've all been nice and even. Much better than that kick from the turnip truck last one. Our referee Hitchcock staying on top of this action, making sure both men are still good. No, this, this is a quality hire. And the fans are getting behind Sam now. A little bit of steam going back into the engine of the Aussie as he feeds an elbow to the solar plexus of John Atlas. Fires off into the ropes. John's ready for him with a devastating spine buster. Hey, I gotta ask you, was there another meeting that I missed before the show? Is Samantha in charge again tonight or what? You don't even know. I'm just expecting Samantha to come out and make some, some garbage change at some point like she did last show. Now, I know you're a little bit upset because your friend Mark Shaw didn't get his friend to lay down for him, but we did get a good match by the end of the that night. That kid took a beating. What a call. Oh, just the, the whitest meat beating. John Atlas sends him up. Nice back backdrop. body drop. Now, John should go for the cover right away. I think he wasted a little bit of time on that one as Osborne kicks out at two. And that's the thing. I mean, he literally took about two seconds, maybe. Maybe. And even in those two seconds, enough for this kid to get the wherewithal to come back on it. Absolutely. John needs to stay on top of his opponent. He sends another knee into the kidneys of Sam Osborne. That's definitely going to affect the mobility of Osborne throughout the rest of this matchup. Oh, absolutely. I mean, like I said, he's just going to keep working over that back area. And it's not just the spine. We're talking about his kidneys, his liver. All those things can be uh, absolutely affected by this. All right. Sam trying to fight back a little bit. We're going to fight to John. A few forearms. Goes up for a hurricane. Whoa. Rana. My God. And I he executes it. it. Goes for the cover. John rolls him over. Sam gets a shoulder up. He looks like he's trying to lock him in with some sort of uh, some sort Submission. of triangle choke. Ask him, ref. Ref 
Tap's waving it off. The fans are behind Sam Osborne here tonight just chanting Tap. John Atlas is still in this matchup as he gets his hand on the bottom rope. Sam Osborne with a, with a clean break at three. full count there too. That's, that's important. He absolutely stretched that submission out as far as he possibly could. All right, as he pops him up and a devastating power bomb to the Aussie. I gotta be honest with you, I was surprised that that power bomb came so late and that he didn't pull the power bomb off out of the work and running to begin with. But now into a straight sheer leg lock, similar to Lance Storm. Shut your mouth! John Atlas just wrenching the pressure down onto the lower back of Sam Osborne as he's trying to work his way to the bottom rope. The fans are definitely behind him here tonight, folks. Oh, as John drags yeah, him back into the middle. Perfect move, Shut dragging him right back into the middle of the ring, into the middle of the ring where he's out of arm's reach. Just keeps wrenching at Osborne, trying to find any way out of this situation. And the Aussie was able to get himself just completely turned so that he was able to, to cause some sort of a difference in the lock that, uh, that Atlas had on the ankle. Atlas just brings a relentless assault to the spine of Sam Osborne, dropping his knee down there on the lower back. Sam's just rolling in agony. I tell you, it's it's tough that uh, it's tough in this territory where you're going to find a guy that's put together as John Atlas. Looking for a pile driver, they're not quite. Gets tossed back over. Osborne now trying to catch his wind while in the corner, but he needs to get his eyes back on the prize or he's going to get kicked in the mush. I will have to say I admire the dedication and fighting these two gentlemen here tonight. I am a fan of this new John Atlas we are here. I don't care about your opinion. Tonight. John Atlas back in March has kind of left his, his own tag team partners there. I like that he's actually bringing the fight this evening. But I'll tell you something, John's been away from here for a little while, so I mean not only were the fans, fans clamoring to get him back, but he, we don't know where he's been. We don't know what he's been doing. Maybe he's just been rep maxing and relaxing and missing out on uh, needed training. Oh, and if he's going to take a beating like this, oh, firing elbows. elbows. Sam Osborne is fired up here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. As he fires him off into the ropes, John Atlas. Is that Lariat? A cross body of sorts. Sam Osborne is fired up. The fans are behind him here tonight. What can he pull out from up his sleeve? John's in the corner, gets out of the way just in time. Sam's on the second rope, jumps to the third. Springboard cross body, goes for the cover, kick out at two and a half. I'm stunned. That momentum should have carried him through. He just he has to stay on top of John Atlas here. He needs to no, keep bringing the fight. No, he's taking way too much time in between. And this shows the inexperience and the youthful exuberance of this young man. As Sam Osborne climbs to the top rope, Ridiculous kangaroo on his tights. What can we see here as uh, John Atlas ducks underneath, goes up for a kick, and he's, uh, he's caught halfway through, rolls underneath, kick to the gut, drops him in. He's going to go for the... Oh, it, Sam Osborne wiggles out, and it ends up Gurry just dropping Atlas down to his knees. He hit him harder than a Men at Work CD. Whew. Sam Osborne goes back up to the top rope. Maybe he can hit what he was going for before, folks. Oh, Dexy's Midnight Runners! Beautiful bomb by Osborne. Goes for the cover. Falls kick, the move. kick out at two. Sam Osborne just looks devastated. He needs to he needs to keep the fight going to John Atlas here. He needs to pull the win out. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know what his medication schedule is like. Osborne just mocking John Atlas there, saying you better, better get relentless playboy. As he sends him up for the suplex, John no. gets out. Sends him off in a super Incredible. kick. Incredible. Goes for the cover. Sam's underneath the bottom rope and kicks out at two. Would you say almost a desperation move in throwing that super kick? It, it looked as though it had enough lightning on it, but did it have enough grease? You are right there. As John is still down for the count, he is not back up to his feet yet. I think he uh, he went to the wall with that super kick. Four. Is that a dirt bag four. Jordan Yates just hanging around eating a bag of chips. Yeah, looks like it. Wow, he must be up to something tonight. These two men are just slapping each other back and forth. Also 
Osborne with an elbow. Atlas with an elbow. Straight forearm by Sam Osborne and a right hook by John Atlas. Both men just firing back as Sam gets the upper hand and keeps, keeps it going. Nice European uppercut sending John Atlas into the corner. Firing up. John sends him over. Wow. For a second, I thought he was taking out cameraman Clinton there. Quite the elevation as he goes over for the springboard into Eats the Eats that super. boot again. As John's ready to send him up. Shoulder bomb. No, maybe not into a turn. John goes for the cover. Beautiful. Atlas, John Atlas picks up the win here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. What an incredible athlete this John Atlas is. And I've been saying it since I met the guy. But easily one of the more put together guys here in, this, in Ontario. And also pro wrestling Ontario. We need to get this guy back here more often. I tell you, I would love to manage a guy like John Atlas. And I, I mention it a lot that I, I, all these guys I'd love to manage. Who knows? Maybe I'm going to dust off the old cart soon enough. Maybe I come back. Show you guys what it's like. I mean, Elias just got beat up last show. He's not around anymore. Looks like John Atlas has some words for the fans here at Pro Wrestling so Ontario. And I know these people specifically came all the way from Brantford. Like, those people came from Brantford. That doesn't even matter. Like, these people are not, they're not Burlington. They're not the type of, of people that come from Burlington. They're Rip Impact fans. Oh, he's beat. Oh. oh. Too much. Too much, Johnny. That man's a former MMA fighter. You be careful. John Atlas seemed to bit bite up a little bit more than he could chew there with that one. That fan has one lucky dad. Be careful. Former MMA fighter Tim Markley does not put up with gun.